How do you? Today I'm going to show you all the process I went through in changing an iPhone 5 S5 battery. I putting it on charge, it will not take charge. I tried the power button and the home button while the cable is connected to the charging port. Nothing is being done. I'm not sure if it's a battery problem, if it's a charging problem, but it's just dead. So I ordered this on Amazon and I would be changing the battery to see if it will come on. The battery is in this. It comes with a instruction manual on the procedures that you have to take and also some tools. Adhesive tape to stick the battery. A prying tool. Uh, I call that a plunger to lift up the battery. screwdriver kit it has some tips in it five of them with different screwdriver or different bit screwdriver bits which you just stick it you unscrew here whatever bit you want to use you push it in here and you tighten that it pushes in when you need it you pull it out it comes with some screws and a prying tool to take out the sim card tray Two screwdrivers, I call them screwdrivers, but their name, two prying tool, that's to pry it open, and a tweezer. With all that said, I would like you to subscribe to my channel. This is a new channel I just opened. And uh, like my videos. With all that said, let's begin. You have two screws here, which you have to get out first make sure to put the screws somewhere that you want misplace them or they want move usually I have a, a battery a magnet to put them on then you take this you put it 
close to the home button. There is a ribbon right here and there's ribbons down here. So while prying, you have to be very careful that you don't pull it up to destroy the ribbon. Once you get it in, you work your way around you behind it clicking, which means it, it's getting out from the Thing and this is a ribbon right here, which you have to be very, very careful not to damage. Yeah, and when I checked the video after I put everything together. I realized <clears throat> that my battery ran down so I'll just go through the procedures to show you all what I did but I've changed the battery this is the old one At the beginning of the video, I told you all about a cable. That's the home button cable. It's connected <clears throat> right here. I hope you all can see it. But to get the battery out, that plate right here has two screws one there the other one here <clears throat> once you loosen these two screws you pry out the plate and you disconnect the battery then the battery have adhesive underneath it you would use a pry tool either one like this or you would use what the kit comes with which you would be able to get underneath it uh, much better and pry it out but apart from that all went well it's just that now putting everything together I notice I have a problem with the home button but I won't be tackling the home button right now I will just uh, close it up connect it back together and call it a D. To put the ribbon in, you don't have much to go on. And the ribbon is like paper.
which you have to be very careful with it. Uh, you have to be delicate with it to get it back in uh, Just remember the top here, there's about two or three ribbons, which you cannot move it too much. You have to work <clears throat> by feel because that thing is so tiny. Okay, I heard. Uh, I think I. I guess one day make these phones. you to out from the bottom you'll put them back on here other one 
give me this one. If for some reason you do give me the Samsung, please tell me why in the description uh, below. This is a new channel I just created and this would be the second video I'll be putting up on it. With that said, the things I used, I'll be putting them in the description. With that said, bye. Later.